sprung and oh that's pretty oh my goodness this is beautiful good morning guys uh, hopefully you guys are having a great day today we are going to be opening up a guardians rising booster box and this is actually going to be a pack battle against collective pokemon there's a link to this person's channel in the description um but yeah let's just crack into this thing and i'm gonna be real with you guys i think that this set right here is going to become a very very expensive set once they stop printing it and here's the reason why i think that there is obviously a very expensive playable card in this set and i think that you know even after this goes out of print um it will still be in format and then during that time i i, I seriously think that it will become a highly sought after card uh, we saw a very similar pattern with Roaring Skies, sorry, I'm just trying to get like a beautiful little thumbnail. Ooh, that looks pretty. That looks pretty cool, right? No, no, it doesn't look cool. Oh man, dang it, I tried. I tried, I'm just trying to be cool here. All right, anyways, so yeah, we saw something really similar with Roaring Skies, where basically like Shaman, very popular, expensive card. Um, and then, you know, when the set released, they were like, wait, how can I like... Here, we're just gonna... Ooh, that's a good pack. We're starting strong, guys. It's a good sign. Victini Hollow. Here's the code card. I will give you guys the code every time you call an altered. How does that sound? Does that sound okay? Okay. So, back to the Roaring Skies discussion. So, what we saw with that set was... Ooh, Vanillix. Um, was basically, like, after... So, the Shaman was running... I think it was running for around $30 to $40 when this set first released. And then for a while, you know, it dipped in price a little bit. Absolute Reverse and a Rayquaza. Um, but then after that, it stopped going out of print. This was before they, it got, like, reprinted and re-released and stuff. Oh, 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 Sylveon, Gothrita, and a Sylveon! Oh, that is so pretty, yo. Seriously, one of, like, my favorite Pokemon, Sylveon, right there. So I'll carefully set that down. Here is the code card for you guys. Um, so, what I, I mean, obviously don't invest, like, thousands upon thousands of dollars into this set, but I, I would recommend that if you are looking to potentially buy some sealed products and sit on it for a while, this might be the set to consider. With that being said, if you totally disagree with this, that is, like, completely fine. If you think that I am so wrong and that this set is just gonna dip in value with time, like... Oh, Tapu Coco GX, two Ultra Rares in a row. Wow, that that's that's incredible. Um, here's the ultra, the code card. I would love to like have a discussion and like talk about this. And I think that that's something that's a really interesting aspect of Pokemon, like this investing aspect. Like some people actually like just buy cards and just sit on them and keep them sealed. And I think that that's like the weirdest thing. It's like a weirdest. It's a weird concept that I would have never thought about. Like. As soon as I buy a product, I, like, open it and want to see, like, what I get in it. But there are some people who, like, re invest, like, religiously into Pokemon cards. And I think that that's really interesting. So, anyways, that, that was my little weird discussion that I wanted to talk about today. That's the weird stuff that goes through my mind, in case you were wondering. Beldum and an Oracorio! Hello! Hello, Mr. Oracorio! Actually, that one actually looks more like a girl, but you know what? It's 2017. We can't judge. Um, moving on. I'm getting worse and worse at opening these packs. A minor, that's a reverse rare, and oh, Blissey Hollow. She just looks lovely today. How are you doing, Blissey? I'm still talking to Pokemon cards. Okay. I'm not sure if the fact that I'm sitting in front of a camera talking to myself is more sad, or the fact that I'm trying to talk to Pokemon. Like, hi, Turtonator, what's up? And then, like, I get sad that there's no response. Like, they're, they're cardboard. Like, I'm... It's cardboard, Hannah. Seriously? Seriously? Oh, white code. That's a good sign. That's a good sign. Gothita and... Oh, oh, oh. oh my goodness. That's beautiful. Hall of Full Art. And you know what? We are doing really well with this box. This is already our third ultra rare. That's crazy. Okay, so here's the code card. It's a beautiful white code. Alright, let's continue on. Uh, we're not even halfway done yet, and I think we're doing a pretty freaking good job. These packs, though, they are so hard to open. I don't know if I'm just getting weaker. Like, it's pretty early in the morning. Maybe I just haven't, like, worked out yet. I just kidding. I never work out. 
because I am just so unhealthy. <laughs> it's in moments like these, these Pokemon videos, they just make me realize that my life decisions are not smart. Chandelure Hollow, very cool. I will take that any day. All right, three, four more packs. I can count sometimes. Oh, that was a weird sound. Sounded like, like a chipmunk or something. I don't know. Whiskash. Sounded like a Whiskash. I wonder what sound a Whiskash makes. Can someone please let me know, like, what sound a Whiskash makes? Sorry, I keep revealing the codes. That, like, ruins the suspense. Murkrow and a Whalelord. He's just having his own little party right there. Whalelord party, Whalelord party. Everyone's invited to my Whalelord party. That sounded like Landlord party for some reason. Alright, we have... Probopass and another Oracorio! He just looks so strong and he's, he's just ready to have a dance battle. Alright guys, someone, someone do a dance battle with Oracorio and if if so, like, I will love you forever. Ooh, Heliolisk. Heliolisk! And these are like, sort of, look at these, they're like, kind of miscut. Let's see if the back, oh, the back doesn't look that bad. It's a little bit miscut. It's not a big deal. We aren't gonna all die, but like I'm like low key dead. Cause oh my gosh, it's miscut. Sorry. All right, we have choke and swallow. Oh man, oh man. Also, guys, starting tomorrow, I am going to be releasing a quick little like update video. Um, and if you you know if you have the time, I would appreciate if you watch that because um. I'm going to be announcing some new series and um, some stuff that's been on my mind, and I feel like it is long overdue that I do an update like this. So, anyways, if if you got a spare minute or two tomorrow's video, if you could just give it some love, I would really appreciate it, and I would really love to know your thoughts on it um, because as I'm creating these new series and these new ideas, um, if you don't like them, right now is the perfect time to speak up and say, "Yo, it's lame. Don't do it." Or, oh, I like it. Do more of it. Um, so anyways, just stuff like that. Um, obviously, this channel is very much our channel. We built this together. So um, I really need your feedback in moments like this as we pull a beautiful Mudsdale Hollow. And with that being said, let's move on to our next pack. We have a cast form. I always thought cast form. Oh my gosh, another Oracorio? Oracorio dance party. This one actually looks like it's dancing. I swear, the Oracorio little birdies, they just love to dance. Okay, anyways, like I was saying, cast form. That is, for some reason, always been one of my, like, favorite Pokemon. It, just, it looks so interesting. Oh, what the? I don't even, what? We have upside down, backwards, Alolan Golem. Okay, well, that's a thing. All right, then. And what else do we have? Dun -dun -dun, Lampet and a Probo Pass. You know what? There was once I saw like a box where they were actually like the pack had like all hollow cards. And it was like it was the weirdest thing. So guys, we gotta we gotta check, we gotta make sure we didn't pull like extra hollows or anything. Because like what if we did? And then that would just be wild. No? No? Alright, well, I thought it would be wild, okay? So Galio Reverse and a Pangoro. Guys, we're coming down to the end of the box again. Don't forget to go check out Collective Pokemon. Link to his channel in the description. Dun -dun -dun. And Hound's Hammer and a Haunch Crow. Alolan Geodude starting off this pack. Maybe we can pull another upside down. No, that's not upside down, my friends, but that is gorgeous. Terminator GX. Beautiful stuff. And here is the code card. Thank you guys so much for watching. Okay, continuing on. We have a Lolan Vulpix and a Salazzle. Salazzle, bedazzle, bewazzle. That was not a thing. That is not a statement. But that's okay. All right. Oh, 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 Gliscopod. I still say it wrong. And oh, that's pretty. Metagross GX. That's nice. Okay. There's that. Here's the code. Couple packs left. I think this is a pretty solid box. Obviously no crazy expensive cards, but st still a very nice box as we pull a Garbodor. That's a very cool rare to get. And dun -dun -dun. we have a reverse Chansey and another Oracorio. Guys, I swear, this is a dance party video, okay? At the end, 
like I better I better see comments of you guys just saying like you had a dance party. <gasps> you know what, guys, guys, we're gonna do it. If so, you guys comment, okay, what your favorite music is like to to, to have a dance party with, okay? Like, pick one song, and if somehow one of those comments gets above 100 likes, I will literally post a video of me dancing to whatever song you pick, okay? 100 likes, though. That was, that was the thing. Well, last time we did something like this, and it was, like, with the monkeys, and I said I would, like, stop hating the monkeys if it got over 100 likes. Like, if one comment got over 100 likes. And y'all did it. So, if you guys can do it with this, okay, I will have a dance party with whatever music you choose. Whatever song you want, I will do it. As long as that comment is like the name of a song and that comment gets a hundred likes okay that's that's my challenge for you guys today so if you're in, if you're reading through the comments which by the way there's some really awesome people in the comments like you guys are cool um hundred likes and i will literally post a video of a dance battle okay sylveon and hala very nice box uh nothing like insanely crazy we didn't get any like hyper rares and like the stuff that we should be doing backflips around, but like, you know what guys, this is gorgeous, this is beautiful, I am thankful to be opening up Pokemon cards, and I'm thankful to be sharing this beautiful experience with you guys. With that being said, again, don't forget to check out Collective Pokemon, link to his video in the description, thank you for watching, and guys, I hope you're ready, I hope you're ready for a dance party! Okay, yep, yep, are you sure you really want that dance party video? Uh, it's probably gonna be lame. <laughs> I'm just kidding guys. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye guys